A year ago, if you asked me where I'd be today, I'd never tell you I'd be standing in the studio working for myself. Let me rewind it back to October of 2016. I was sitting in my boss's office talking about the yearly review. We were talking about how, how popular and how busy we were becoming, how popular our YouTube was getting and the growth on it. We were kind of laughing about it because we didn't expect it to become what it was. And then it came time to talk about my yearly review. I'll never forget this conversation because it went kind of like this, you know, my boss and good friend Sean at the time looks at me and he goes, okay, well, you've been doing awesome, we've grown, and I'll give you that or that raise that you want, but it's going to come at a price. You're going to have to be available 24-7, which pretty much means you're going to have to give up all your side photography jobs and your music career. I sat there staring because I didn't know what to say. That's a huge step, you know, I, I've taken so much time to, to build what I've got. On one hand, I would make the amount of money that I never imagined possible. And on the other hand, I would have to give up pretty much everything I've worked for for the past 15, 20 years. You know, as I'm sitting there staring at him, I, I can remember it because he looks at me, he goes, I'll give you that raise. But honestly, I, I, I know you don't want to do that. I know you don't want to give up. And honestly, I don't want you to because I did the same thing, I, you know, and look where he's at, you know, so. He looks at me. And he goes, "I, I know you. You know, I know you're not gonna do that. So, right now, I'm gonna consider this your two-week notice." Uh, I didn't know what to say because my own boss, who wanted me to work for him and help build the company, knew what I needed to do before I even need knew what I needed to do. So I went home and I talked to my wife and I told her, "You know, look, I, I gave up the opportunity to make all the money that I've wanted for years to do this full time." And I gotta tell you, she has stood by me the entire time and I will never be able to thank her enough for what she has done. So here I am, you know, just quit my job to, to go full time in photography. And I gotta tell you, I've looked back I look back on it now and I have done more and seen more in the last year than I can ever imagine. I have traveled doing photography gigs all over the place with some amazing people doing what I love. It's, it's just mind-blowing to think about that. So I guess what I'm trying to say is if you have a passion and you have a drive for something, go for it, man. Find somebody that can help you start. Find somebody that can give you the guidelines that, have, that has been there. And, and don't be afraid to reach out to me even if you need need help. If you have that drive and that passion, you, you got to go for it. You got you to gotta try it. I mean, yeah, it's, it's a struggle. I still struggle every day. I don't know if I'm going to get another gig, but when I do, it, it's that that's what drives me I mean that's that's what makes me go do it go for it you know it try and honestly you don't know if you have that drive if you're afraid to get out of park